believe that to an extent. But they it, they knew that and didn't care. And there's a disconnect with that. There, I mean, there's like some kind of chemical imbalance in your brain where you're not understanding that that is not an appropriate way to uh, to joke. That's that that is not an appropriate way to joke. Now this is a whole it'd be a whole different story if you know somebody said you know you know ha ha jokes on you long time ago. Still wouldn't be funny. Yeah, still wouldn't be funny. But now it, it's never funny. But at some point in time, you, there there's got to be some kind of clarity or you know. Because the truth's gonna come out regardless. Yes, Lord. That's, that, that's the yes, part. Lord. That's the part that I, I think, you know, the person that tells the lie is not. They they missing that in a noodle somewhere. You know, I think they should straight up lock their ass the fuck up. Uh, lock them up and study that shit. Yep, lock them up. Because them. people people out there that's like that shouldn't. Shouldn't be in general society, you know, mucking up people's lives because that's a muck. Well, let me ask you this: Why all of a sudden people gotta be ill and mentally ill when they commit a crime that they know they're gonna get their ass in trouble? Well, I mean, that's your, I mean, how you just gonna snap into an ill mode when you're in that courtroom? You know you going to jail. You gonna snap into an ill mode? Just like they say when that boy went down there and killed all them people at that movie theater. He crazy. Okay, you went crazy before you went. Now your ass done got caught. All of a sudden, now you got a problem. That's my question. How, how you know that person been on the line? Now this shit all catching up. Now when that person get to the courtroom, or if that person ever ever should get to the, court, I know they gonna get there. As soon as they find out who this person is, that person get to the courtroom. Is that the first thing they gonna holler? Is this person need is mentally sick? Need help? I mean, but damn, let a negro go to the motherfucking courtroom. If I done went out here and shot three people. Or you went out here and shot three people. Or she went out there and shot three people. Now they go to the courtroom and holler that mentally ill shit. They ain't gonna give a fuck. <laughs> Bitch, you going to jail. Fuck that. You ain't ill. Because you weren't ill before you committed that shit, was you? <laughs> you weren't ill. You weren't ill when you pulled the trigger. You weren't ill when you loaded it. So that motherfucker was ill when she was on line. That motherfucker had sense enough to know how to spell. <laughs> That motherfucker had sister know how to come up with that fake ass name. <laughs> that motherfucker had sister to pick up the phone and call. So where the fuck do the mentally ill come from? No damn where. Cause that ass nigga, that ass that got caught up now, now your ass ill. Hell yeah, I'll be ill too. <laughs> I'll be an ill ass nigga. For real. Oh, I'm sick. Oh, goodness. Where am I? I started tripping out in the courtroom like, oh goodness, I started feeling on my face like, whoa, what is this? This is amazing. You know, is this a guess? What the fuck is this? Huh? What you ask me? I don't come, I don't, I don't, I don't comprehend that. All right, that's not funny. And shit, the hell that, if it ain't. It, 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 uh, it's not funny in a humorous sense, but I, I hear you. I hear you 100%. But you, you hit me with a couple of issues. And I, I, I mean, I don't know how to address each one. However, what I, what I think would be more productive for society is that you lock them up, but you also study those type of people. Say, for instance, in this Mateo incident, you know what I'm saying? And that person come out and say X, Y, Z. For argument's sake, this person comes out and say, yes, I'm the one that made this man think that I was... Uh, this woman who had leukemia and then died. All right, all of that shit is a joke. It, it, it's my fault. All right, so this person comes out. They need to lock that some bitch up. They is. And study that some bitch. I want I want my tax dollars to go to see what the fuck is wrong with you. I want to know why you you think it's a good idea to shoot your mama twice, take her heat. Go down to your local school, your first local school you thought about. Gun down everybody in the building and gun yourself. I want to know what in the fuck is wrong. Is are you possessed? Are there demons and shit that's been working around this earth that we Hell need? Hell yeah! 
I mean, well, you, they need to say that shit. The devil, they ain't gonna say that's the shit I, they wanna keep saying. Yeah, I know. It's, you know, I don't. I don't believe that that God. You said, you know, woo to woo. I mean, God is omnipresent and omniscience, and he 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 has he's the ruler. He's the king of all kings. That's right. It, whatever he say, go. But I, I'm I, I'm having a disconnect, you know, just being a human, you know, I'm in this flesh, but I'm having a disconnect to believe that, you know, God said do that. So I'm, in my logical brain, you got to explain that to me. You got to explain that to me why I, all right, you got to explain to me why would a person do, a, you know, why would a person just come up with some fake shit to another person and think that's funny? Why? I'm, I need to know why. Is there some kind of... Uh, what, what's going... What, where's the disconnect in your brain that you think that is funny? And then want to say, oh, okay, well, such and such died. Or, you know, your family member died. And call up motherfuckers and be like, hey, man, your people's died. And think that's funny. W w you know, something wrong there. It's been me, boy. If TJ would have called here talking about TD, your cousin, Rick. Down, I'm telling I was damn lot go down there and probably be ready. You know, I'll yeah. be wrong, but hey. Exactly. Hey. My, uh, that, that's, that's, <laughs> you know, that's constant. You would be totally wrong. You would go to jail for umpteen years. However, comma, what about this motherfucker that just told you this ill ass information? His ass is going with me. He's either going to jail or going to hell. Which one he going? Which way he want to go? I mean, yeah, you know, I'm pretty sure a guy go straighten all that part out. I'm going to get his ass there quicker, though. But yeah, you and, I'm saying you're a human being. You're in the flash, man. You ain't knowing no better. All you know is you be lied to. So your natural impulse is be like, I'm going to get this person yeah, buddy. or. You know, or I'm going to go, I'm going to either get this person or I'm going to go into deep ass depression and not trust another motherfucker on this planet. Ever. <laughs> I mean, because his whole NFL career could be fucked right now. If he, they find out he had something to really do with that shit. Either or. That's what I'm trying to say. Either if he, it, even, either or. If they find out that he had something to do with it and or if he was just really that damn stupid to, to fall for some shit like that. Either or. His 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 stock level is dropping. Yeah, you're right. I need that. On on the NFL basis, his stock level. I need that. The the owner of the Patriots is not going to look at that motherfucker like, yeah, I need him on my team now because I don't know if he's going to be smart enough. He might be that Pac-Man Jones type motherfucker who want to go off in the club and make it rain. Boy, let me be that what it do. <laughs> That's all I want. Just uh, call I mean, me. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. You know. Yeah, you do get ready to make it rain. I'm gonna be the first to know it. Need to be the first in. But yeah, that's a that's a problem. And it ain't cool. No, it's not at all. I don't even, man. I don't see no fun. This and I don't see a joke nowhere in that situation. And if he had anything to do with it, you know what? May God bless him. That's right. all I got right. to say. May right. God bless you. Straight up. Because <laughs> there is a big ass point to the whole thing. And if it does get people... It, you know what? If this situation gets people to talk to their kids and have them have more awareness and, and you know, makes makes their, their parents want to check a little bit more of who they talking to online, great purpose. Uh, a, a little bit more. I mean, if Sandy Hook made you, made you hug your kid a little bit longer, then this Mateo incident should have you knowing your kid's password, you know, to be able to check their shit online. To make sure they not Mateo or Catfish. Or, you know, the little kids is, is, you know, can be duped too. Yeah, but there's nothing, it's, it's just, to be honest with you, all, really, there's nothing you really can do if you're not in the flesh for real. There's nothing really... Anything online, there's nothing really you can do. There's really nothing you can do. You can check my password all you want. You can check your kids' password all you want. It still does not stop here from being in a situation maybe like that. It's not going to stop. That, that that can't be stopped right there. Don't wait. That can be stopped. Home bringing? Home, I mean, you know, straight Let's up. Meet. Parenting? That's me. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, how you doing? That's me. I'll meet your, I'll meet your parents. You know what I'm saying? Parents and parents and me. You know what I'm saying? If you know you kid, whatever, you know, we far away. We need to talk. We need to, you need to call me. You know what I'm saying? We need to call on the phone. We need to make some kind of reservation where we can meet. 
we we got to meet that line. I'm telling you, it is not gonna stop. It's not gonna stop. Anything online can be any kind of figment of anybody's imagination. Anything, even the spaceship they show online. We know a lot of people know, you know, around the area that it is true. It is true that that the governor, the government, or whatever, got some kind of secret shit going on that they ain't trying to let the people out here know about in the world because they don't want people to get scared, panic, and all. I understand that. I do. You know, I don't blame. I probably keep your shit a secret too. But at the same time, you still should let people know. You know what's around them, what's possibly. You know what may be. You we still need to know. You don't need to keep that in your head. We need to know. You know what I'm saying? We don't need no. Um, Shit that we can't solve. Everything here we need to be able to solve. We don't need nothing here that we cannot solve. And the internet thing you cannot solve unless you put a stop to it. Like you putting a stop to the guns on the street. If you got to put a stop to the gun in order for people to not get their head fucked with and played with and raped and killed or whatever it may be, it has to stop. The world, nigga, the world is coming to an end with the quickness. It's the end. Every day is something. First it was first it was